Hello, I'm Anula here again for uh, Journals Junks for Junkies and I wanted to do this video that you guys requested me about my journal that is for the event. It's a it's a red and pink journal. Um, this is a journal for the closed group like I said. I did this book the cover using this um cover this is from rice so the dimensions of this books are eight and a half by five and a half and three inches in the spine this book has five signatures that you can see so there's a lot of pages for you to journals um, in the front i decide to take this image from Pinterest is the vintage lady in red and I embellish the front of the book with a saying hoping your day is as wonderful as you are and then I did a tool flower a butterfly this is the closing and then I use scene binding ribbons to close the book like you see the book is very chunky and then the side of the book has a chain that I did with different charms in red. And then I use some seam binding and another charm here that matches the closure. The back is the box of chocolate that I use as a pocket to put another book in. And I use a, an eyelet to talk the ribbon for the seam binding. So the seam binding here, you will open the book like so. And we'll start with the face, the first page. The first page you're gonna find here, it's a bag that has a tag that I decorate with a lot of embellishments in red colors. And you can journal in the back if you want or put a picture or whatever I left a lot of tea dye blank pages in this book because it's a huge book but I embellished some of them here you can see one that I embellished with some stamping and some um, decorations we have a little envelope here where there's a tag inside I use scrapbook paper, a combination of tea dye and Kool-Aid dyed paper. Here's another one. I have catalog pages. Here's another page that I decorate with uh, another talk spot for you. Here's another decoration that you can flip and you get some tickets that are in there that you can use for whatever you want. This page has the three butterflies, and then you can kind of pop it up if you want. Um, another area, this is the first signature. It's vellum, and you got a tuck spot there. Another page where I decorate with a rose, and I put a mason jar there for you that kind of match the butterflies. Flowers that goes with another tuck spot. More scrapbook pages. Here is some tea Kool Aid pa uh, paper dyed, and I put some glimmer mist to add the shimmer. Here is a vellum tuck um, pocket with a number in. I still have to put ribbons there. Here is the tea dye pages with Valentine and I left a bunch of those for you to put pictures or things that you want. Um, here is another page with a heart and here's another with a doily and two little tags inside. This is a chandelier that is made of felt so I put it in there. I thought it will be a nice touch since we're talking banners. Another talk spot that you can put in there. Maybe a tag. 
um, some embellishment ribbon, a heart, another vellum spot, some doilies that I decorated and put it on the edge. Here you can see, here's another corner where you can tuck something if you want to. Here you get this pocket with three little, three little um, tags with different messages in them. Um, here is the tea dye. I left that mostly for journaling. Here is another space with, that I had with felt and a nice flower. And then you can journal and put pictures. Tea dye paper. Scrapbook paper. This is the middle of another signature. Like I say, it's five signatures. Another tuck spot with a tag. Paper. I'm trying to go quick. This is another page I did decorate with love. I put some prompts in here for you to journal. If I could talk for some person from my past, who should I talk to? A day in my life. Television shows I love. Here's another pocket with another little tag. Here's a flip book that you can flip and there's little tags in here for you to write in. This I purpose from uh, some socks. An envelope with tags, another tuck spot, more tea dye paper and Kool-Aid paper. Another corner here that you can use to put anything. Decorated love is all we need with three hearts. Kiss, kiss, kiss. And there is this little um, clip with some lips. Um, here are pages to journal. Here's another pocket. Another decorated part of the other envelope with a tag in. Another... You have another spot in here with a little um, pocket in it. More pages with more of your little stickers. My family is, things that drive me crazy. And here's more scrapbook paper. This is the middle of the book. I did a lot, kind of a little mini book in here for you to put photos. Another picture of the vintage later lady. Uh, clothespin. Here is a tag that I make for this book that is here. And another page with another beautiful tuck spot. Paper, the back of the book cover with another page for you to journal. And then this is the one. I used some lace trim to put all around the book. And this is a crochet flower. And here is the little pocket for the mini book where you can journal. And then you have a, even a tuck spot in there. And it goes all there. So then when you close your book, like I say, I use lace all around it. And I use a, a kind of a ribbon to cover this. Here is the little dangling. And the front of the book again. So I hope you like me enjoy my book. Lots of papers and a lot of space for you to put fun stuff. Um... Like I say, I did it with five signatures, lots of scrapbook paper, tea dye paper, use seam binding for the book. And I hope whoever get this book really enjoy it. And I'm looking forward to doing this swap. 
thank you to Laura and all the people who are in this event and um, love being part of Junk Journals for Junkies and I hope you enjoy my book. So thank you.